I'm hearing a word pop up uh, several times, and a choice, what we choose. So I think people kind of think things happen, but how often are we actually making them happen? Well, it, it, and a lot of what I like to speak about has to do with things like stress and confidence. And that word choice does come up a lot. And it, my belief is that very little happens not by choice. We, again, think that we're out of control of most of life. And the reality is, no, actually, we're quite in control. The challenge, I think, really, is that we tend to, to focus on the things over which we have very little control. And so it makes us feel out of control. That's why people often talk about things like the weather and the traffic and the stock market and other people. Everyone's driving me nuts. And the reality is, how many of those things can you control? None. So we're wrestling with these things, and we have no ability to change them. That's exactly right. And the, the thing is, you don't really have choices with things when you don't have control over them. So we try to do that. It doesn't work. It's never going to work. The other flip side of that, of course, is what do we have control over? That I have total ability to make choices on. So it's a small list. Me. I can control how I choose to respond to those things, what I do with those, whether I walk away or I continue on with something. Those are all choices I can make. <clears throat> Excuse me, and I have control over that. And that's just, it's so interesting, because it is. It, we kind of keep running so fast, we don't realize some of these kind of default operations we have in our, you know, we've done them for years. We react a certain way, and there is a short list of things we can control. Imagine what would happen if we focused more time there. Yeah, yeah, and you think about the time. You know, if you go through a single day, and consciously just be aware of how often I'm focusing on things over which I have no control. You will be amazed at how much time and energy we waste on that stuff. And again, we say, boy, I wish I had more time. I wish I had more energy. I wish I had more everything. You know what? It's all sitting here. And it's not to say you have to stop all of this stuff because you can't. That's not realistic. Right. It's not real life. You have to participate in life and everyone else's lives and environments and surroundings and situations. That's part of the game. It's part of the fun almost. But to be able to pinpoint a few things here, and I loved how you hit on really the idea of habits. We're, on, we're in this default mode, this autopilot. Yeah. And if we can get out of autopilot or off of autopilot, we can find one or two or three things here and bring that time over here, and all of a sudden, now we've become productive, not busy. Right. It's a being more intentional, it sounds like. It's uh, a great with word. What we're doing.